and welcome to a Pokemon pack battle of sorts. The uh, two booster boxes we have will be battling not each other and not another person, but we're going to battle pack artworks to find out which pack artwork has the best pulls. Um, my guess is they all probably have about the same uh, number of ultra rares, solar rares, uh, amazing rares, whatever in them. But we will find out. We will uh, break this up into um, quite a few episodes just because uh, I don't like really long videos. So, but the pack artworks will be battling each other. Um, and whichever one has the best pulls, we'll know at the end. So let me just take a moment to get set up here. And then we'll begin. Hey there, and welcome to episode 15 of our Vivid Voltage Pack Artwork Pack Battles. To find out what pack artwork has the best pulls. And if you've been with us for a while, you'll know as no surprise that Zarude... Celebi, Pikachu, and Orbeetle, in that order. So if you're looking for a pack, Zerud's the way to go. Um, if you haven't been with us for a while, please check out the uh, the playlist. Uh, this is episode 15, so you might be a little bit behind. But you don't have to watch them in order, or all of them, because they don't really pertain to each other. We just like to know, I like to know, by we, which one is best. Zerud is winning. Selby is coming back. Like I said before, if any of them pull a uh, Secret Rare Pikachu, it's just auto wins. It's like, yeah, it's auto winning. But we'll start with the leader in the continuing weird cut Zerud. Ah, there we go. Ooh, green code card. Saru so doesn't get those too often. Uh, Psychic. Glaring Meath. Chimeco. Blitzel. Slugma. Beldum. Electric. Kakuna. Loudred. Reverse Voltor. Reverse Voltorb. And a Lucario non-holographic. So, for the second time in a row, and only the third time overall, Zerud goes without a hit. Without scoring at all. Which means, if Selby gets a good pack, Selby could overtake Zerud. Ooh. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen can close the gap some with an amazing rare, but we haven't seen one of those in quite a while. The last amazing rare we had was what? Episode 4? For real? This is episode 15! We haven't seen an amazing rare since episode 4? I did not realize they were that um, rare. It's amazing. <laughs> Woobat! Taylor Charmander, we pulled Charizard in episode 14. Forgot where we were. Whooper, Girafferig, Delmise, Reverse, Carlos, and Manetric, non holographic. Okay, on to Pikachu. Pikachu's in third place, and by my scoring, which I have. I haven't revealed yet. He is uh, a ways behind. There's the code. Darkness. Can Pikachu pull us a secret rare Pikachu? That'd be awesome. Panfi, Duskull, Electric, Pineco, Mudbray, Wash Energy, Charmeleon, uh, Underwater Push, Pincushion, Pinchurchin, pin, pincurchin, pin. It's an underwater pincushion. Reverse is the same card. I like it. You know me, if you get 
one in reverse of the same. That's always nice. The rare is Waylord. Oh, I like Waylord. I will not complain about a Waylord because he is definitely in my top five favorite Pokemon. Um, yeah, just because. And Orbeetle is a distant, distant last place. And he's not going to get any help here. Beldum, a Moth Bubble, a Wooper, Minkata, Wismer, Trumbeak, Hitmontop, Meg Cargo. Oh! Orbeetle does get some help. A nice Raikou Amazing Rare. And this is only the third one we've pulled, episode 15. So that's one out of every 20 packs I'm averaging. In Mudsdale. But Raikou. Very nice Amazing Rare. Um, we've pulled the Celebi and we've pulled the Rayquaza, there we go. I knew it would come to my mind at some point. Um, anyways, another great poll. And until next time, bye.